know, how are you doing tonight? Great, thank you so much for having me. Yes, of course. So what does it mean to you to be part of the Women's Image Awards, uh, representing Asian Americans, women, the whole thing? You know, it really means a lot. I think that women have come very far in this industry. It has been a very high risk, low reward sort of path, you know, especially if you are a person of color and also if you're queer, you know, all of these sort of like invisibility sort of, uh, I guess, attributes make it harder to become visible. So it's just a really huge honor to be here, especially with my team. We are mostly women. So all of my key heads were women. It was very important to us. And a lot of us are queer and Asian. So it was just like really making like a movie for the world with a sense of community. So yeah, I think that we've come a long way as women in this industry, no matter what role we play in this industry and um, to be here like it's something that would have been impossible just a few decades ago. I yeah. love that so much. Yeah, as an Asian American myself, I totally relate. Yes. It's like it's very rare to see that. These, we have back in the day and seeing so much exposure now is like very heartwarming to me. Yes. You know? uh, so tell me more about your movie, about how you came about directing it, the whole thing. Um, List of a Lifetime was originally a movie called Breast Cancer Bucket List. And it was a script given to me by my producer at Ninth House, Autumn Federici. And uh, I was really burnt out after a series of jobs. And when I read the script I just the first 15 pages I was like I just have to do this it's very important to me to explore mother and daughter themes and the story revolves around a woman who has lived her whole life not pursuing what she wanted she's in her mid 40s played by Kelly Hu and um, she realizes that she has a stage four cancer diagnosis breast cancer and in doing so she has to reconnect with the baby she gave up for adoption you know 20 years ago and inform her of the genetic possible genetic mutation as well so um, she ends up finding Sylvia Kwan who is also our lead who plays her biological daughter and it's about finding you know family again and also Shannon Doherty plays the adoptive mother of um, Talia um, and it just talks about how there's so many opportunities to go back and try again, and uh, that life is always worth living. Yeah. Oh, wow, I love that so much. Sounds Thank amazing. You. Well, congratulations on your success and everything for this, for being here. I love, I love just seeing other Asian American yes. women just being honored. It's like it really fulfills like my heart as well. So congratulations. You too, honey. Yeah. Keep slaying. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank okay. you so much. Welcome to Fab TV. Look at Hollywood's latest. See all the red carpets dressed to a T. Yeah, you know me. It's all free.